Snorkeling off the beach where Magellan's starving remnant leapt from their landing boats, in the leafy shadows, a lazy Komodo flicks its tongue to sample the morning air. Curious pouting fish, like brilliant flags of nations, flutter over the indigo starfish nestling in the coral that grows its filigree on the bones of the lost of Bataan. Above the cliffs, from the Tavon caves, ancient ghosts mark the unfolding histories. Vaporous cirrus softens the starlight. Red ferry clusters weigh heavy on the road. The wind turbine is as still as the wine in a glass. Marley's No Woman No Cry slips out the back door on angles of light that sharpen the blackness where toads stay hidden this crisp late summer night. Where you are, the morning light is yet to break as you make snacks with your mother for the village school children, as your thoughts are of your lost papa. It is time for letting go, and tomorrow for letting go some more. There will be time enough for letting in. Here, on the bonfire, sparks fly up, burying all griefs into the dark, leaving the muted cracking of embers. The old kitchen cupboard gone to ash that speckles my hair. On my hands, the smell of wood smoke. Thank you.